Hello everyone and welcome back to Hannah's Happy Home. So in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys some modest outfit ideas. So in this video, I'm gonna be sharing some new clothing that I got and how I styled it. And I'm also gonna be sharing some outfit ideas with items that I already have in my closet. So I hope that you guys enjoy this video and let's get right into it. So this video is just going to be very casual. I'm just gonna be showing you guys the outfits just right here at my full length mirror. So first I'm gonna be showing you guys some modest workout outfits. And this portion of the video is in collaboration with Snoga Athletics. They recently sent me some of their clothing items. I've been following them for a long time on Instagram, so I was really excited when they wanted to work with me. So Snoga Athletics makes modest workout clothes and I will link their website down below. But first off, they sent me this workout top and this is called the Snoga active top it just is a very flattering workout top and I'm wearing a size medium for size reference this skirt is also from Snoga athletics this is called the midi basic Snoga in the color black and I absolutely love this skirt I love the length of it I like that it's a little bit longer and fuller and I also like that the leggings don't stick out too far underneath it's just the perfect workout skirt I love to wear this skirt everywhere I like to wear it shopping I like to wear it when I'm cleaning it's literally the comfiest skirt ever and for size reference, I am wearing a small, and if you're wondering how long it's going to be on you, I am 5'3", and this is how long it is on me. So this is the second skirt that they sent to me. This one is called the Long Shirt Tail Skirt, and I got this one in a size medium instead of a small, just because it was a little bit of a straighter skirt, and I wanted to make sure that it was still going to be loose. I forgot to say with the other one that all of their leggings are built in underneath the skirts. It just helps you to be able to stay modest while you're hiking or working out or riding bike. And this skirt has the full length leggings, so that's nice for the winter time to help keep you warm. So yeah, a big thank you to Snoga Athletics for sending me some of their workout clothes. Don't forget to go and check them out. I'll have all the links for these items and their website down below. So this sweatshirt was sent to me by the website patpat.com and I am in love with this sweatshirt. It is so comfy. I'm going to be wearing it a lot this winter. The material is really soft and the inside of it is really soft as well. It says mama bear. It's got a little heart and a bear. Super cute. I will put a link for this down below and for size reference, I'm wearing a small. I feel like it runs a little bit big and they said that on their website that it was like an oversized sweatshirt so that's why I sized down to a small and one of my favorite features about this sweater is that it has these really soft brown elbow patches and this jean skirt that I paired this sweatshirt with is from Kato's I always get lots of questions about my jean skirts I get the majority of my jean skirts at Kato's and if you don't have a Kato store near you then you can just go onto their website I'll link it down below I'm not sure if they still have this skirt for sale but if they do then I will link it. And I also paired it with these little light tan ankle boots. I got these last year at Payless. I don't think that they sell them anymore, but if I can find a similar pair, then I will link them down below for you guys. I feel like a pair of neutral colored ankle boots are a necessity for the fall and winter. They can go with so many different outfits. You could also just pair this outfit with like a pair of sneakers or a pair of slip-ons. Okay, so this super cute gray and white striped cardigan was also sent to me by patpat.com. This is so cute and so comfy. It's that really soft material just just like the cardigan. I also got this in a small just like the sweatshirt. This cardigan is just so comfy though. I'm definitely going to be wearing this all throughout the winter. I'll have the link to it down below. I also think that a few cardigans are also a essential for your closet for the fall and winter time. So this is the last piece of clothing that patpat.com sent to me. So a big thank you to them for these clothes. I'm definitely going to be wearing these a lot this winter and I was very impressed with their clothing. Very good quality and very soft like I said. So this next dress was sent to me by Z thebrant.com. I think I'm pronouncing that right. I'll type it up and I'll have it linked down below. They sent me this dress and they actually sent me a bunch of clothes, but I'm only going to be showing you this dress and the next dress because everything else was not that great of quality and it didn't fit very good. But these dresses are actually really good quality. I do really like these and they did fit true to size. So this dress is a style of dress that I probably normally wouldn't wear because it's like this high-waisted style. I just feel like those don't really look very good on me, but I do like this dress. I love all of the embroidery that it has in it. I'll give you a little closer look at all this embroidery. It's got a bunch of little white flowers and then all of the embroidery down the middle. It ties right here at the top. This dress is very nice and full. It's a nice midi length. I'm 5'3", like I said, for size reference. And I paired it with these little brown ankle boots. I like these because they have a little buckle on them. I cannot remember the name of the store that I got these from, but I'll try to find a similar pair and link them down below. And I wore this dress in my Christmas house tour and I did get lots of questions 
questions about it so like I said I will link it down below and this was sent to me so thank you to Zabrant.com for sending me this dress and I also got it in another color which I will show you right now. It also sent me this dress in a blue color and the embroidery in this one is black instead of white. And I'm so sorry this one is so wrinkly. I haven't worn this one anywhere yet so I haven't ironed it but this one is cute as well and I paired this one that with these other like tannish gray boots instead of the other ones because I feel like these ones match better. So like I said I will have the Zabrant website linked down below and also I will have the link for these dresses if you want to go and check them out. They have them in a couple other colors as well and like I said I'm wearing a small in both colors. So I also want to share my favorite jacket for the fall and winter time and this jacket is pretty thin but we do live in Arizona so our days usually don't get that extremely cold so I'm usually able to wear this throughout the winter time. This jacket is definitely one of my most favorite jackets I've ever owned. It's a staple in my closet all throughout the fall and the winter. So next I'm going to share a few outfits that I piece together for my closet. First off, this shirt. I love this shirt. I got this shirt a few months ago, so I don't think that you can buy it anymore, but I'll try to find a similar one online. I love any shirt that has these like bell type sleeves, and I love that this one has the lace detailing on the sleeve, and I also paired this with my Ana Luisa necklace and bracelet. I'll link these down below as well. And I just paired this shirt with this long ankle length denim skirt. This skirt is also from Kato's. I will try to find it and link it down below because I didn't buy it that long ago. I don't remember what size I'm wearing. I think I'm wearing a six. Usually their skirts run about a size big, so I usually size down because usually I would be like an eight in denim skirts. Yeah, this is one of my favorite outfits out of my closet. I love this skirt and this shirt. So this next outfit I wore in a video the other week and you guys really liked it. You wanted to know where everything was from, so I thought that I would share this outfit with you guys. So first off, this vest. I got this at Maurice's like two years ago, I think. They usually have some really cute jean vests in there. I love that this one has some distressing on it right here and right here. I think that jean vests are also a staple to have in your closet for the fall and the winter time. And I got this brown long sleeve shirt at Kohl's years ago and I don't even know if they have them anymore because it's been years since I've been in there and shopped there. But if I can find it then I will link it down below. And I added this gold necklace. I got this gold necklace years ago. I have no idea where I got it from. <laughs> this watch is a staple jewelry piece for me. I wear this with so many outfits throughout the year. I feel like everybody needs a really good watch to go with your outfits. And this olive green skirt. I really love this skirt. It's super comfy and I got this skirt at Forever 21 probably about three years ago so they probably don't sell it anymore. And then I'm pairing it again with these little slip-on ankle boots. These are one of my favorite shoes in my closet right now. And so yeah that is this whole outfit. Okay, so I had to share this next sweatshirt because everybody needs a couple of comfy sweatshirts for the winter time. And this one is from Walmart. It's cheap, it was only 10 bucks, but yet it's really good quality. And the inside of it is like this super soft fuzzy material, so it's really comfy and warm. At Walmart, they have a couple different colors of these and a couple different sayings on them. I chose this one because I really like the mustard color and that it says just add caffeine. And I got this in a size medium so that it would be a little bit oversized. So I know that Walmart still sells this one, so I will be able to link it down below for you guys. And then I paired it with this ankle length denim skirt from Kato's. These are so comfy. The material's really stretchy like I said. I just really love Kato's jean skirts. I think I also love them because they're nice and cheap. Usually most of their jean skirts are anywhere from only $24 to $28, whereas most jean skirts are like $30 to $40. But I will tell you real quick that there's a couple of other websites that sell jean skirts because I get questions all the time about where to get jean skirts. You can go to denimskirts.com. You can go Go to the skirtoutlet.com. I'll try to link as many websites as I can down below for you guys. Those websites are a little bit more expensive than Kato's, but you will get a higher quality skirt, obviously. Okay, so this is going to be the last outfit because this video is getting really long, but I just had to share this sweater that I got from Shein.com recently. I saw this sweater on Shein.com a while ago and I knew that I had to have it because I don't have a lot of sweaters for the winter time and I just really loved this one. I like that it has this dusty pink color in this cheetah material. Here is a little closer look at it. Now I am wearing a small in this sweater and it fits fine everywhere except that it is a little bit short and I saw a couple of other people complaining about that on the website. But but I just paired it with a tank top underneath to help give it a little bit more length. I think this would be really cute if you had this color pink shirt to put on underneath of it, but I just had this navy one, so that's what I paired it with. But it is a really cute sweater. It's really good quality, so that makes up for the fact that it's a little bit short. I'm not sure if sizing up would help it to be a little bit longer or not. I feel like it would just make it bigger at the top and it wouldn't really help, but you never know, but this is what a size small looks like. A couple of cute sweaters are definitely a staple for your closet for the winter time as well, and I really love 
love this one. I'm definitely going to be wearing it a lot this winter. And I just paired it with that same ankle length denim skirt from Kato's and I also put on these little brown ankle boots. And I wore this outfit in a picture on my Instagram on Thanksgiving Day and a couple of you asked about this sweater so I knew that I had to share it. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. It was a little bit different than my normal type of videos, but if you guys really enjoy these outfit idea type videos, then maybe I will do them every once in a while for you guys. And excuse my crazy hair, that's what happens when you try on like a million different outfits. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching and please subscribe if you are new and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.